the task is monumental. But can Daniel deny what seems to be Djokovic's destiny and make it his instead? Both are intellectual samurais as they enter the ground, battleground of hope for a final time in Melbourne this year. Welcome to the 2021 Australian Open Men's Singles Final. Would you please make welcome our fourth seed in the second Grand Slam Final from Russia, Daniel Medvedev. He is our top seed, the world number one defending champion, looking for a record ninth Australian Open title. Please make welcome from Serbia, Novak Djokovic. Huge reception for both players. Just listen to that Serbian support. Let's get down to John Fitzgerald, who's courtside. I believe, Fitzy, you can hear me right now. What an atmosphere. Yeah, this, this is as good as it gets, Mark. And, and these are special moments, aren't they, in, in our tennis world. The, the finals of the Grand Slams, there's four a year. And as an Australian, when players walk onto the court, in your home slam this is a special moment it, it really does um get the you know the the heart rate up and and the emotions rolling i look i look at novak and i think how can you play tennis this well sometimes and two years ago i, I don't think i've seen him play better against rafa in the final i didn't think he could play tennis that well but i did think at the start of this tournament pitch that if there was one player that may give him a shake this year it's Medvedev. It's the guy across the net tonight. Ah, we can. He's going to do the contest first. Daniel, this is Hugo. He's going to do the contest first. Gentlemen, we take a picture with him and the trophy after the contest. Just three reminders. 25 seconds between the points. The clock starts after I've announced the score. Towel boxes, red and blue. Nola, you go for blue. Blue, red for you. And last but not least, if there's a tie break in the final set, it's up to uh, 10 points. You got any questions? No? So you wanna, we be ready to ask Novak if he wants, or Daniel? A and Z or the players? Novak, A and Z or the players? A and Z, okay, ready to go, Hugo. Here we go. And it's A and Z? Surf? Okay, we take a picture, you turn around please. You turn, turn around, turn around. Okay, this way, this way. Perfect. Nico, Nico Helworth, the first German to ever take charge of a, a men's or women's Grand Slam final. Congratulations to him. And Brad, silver is the most precious commodity tonight. Not gold for once. Yeah, that trophy is a beauty. They've kept it well shined in silver. What a tournament it's been. So many twists and turns along the way. But ultimately, these two's routes through converge here in the final. His second final, of course, of a major. Came up short in five epic sets in New York against Rafael Nadal a couple of years ago. Here's the tail of the tape. Currently ranked four, of course, will push on to world number two if he were to win tonight. The 25-year-old from Russia, of course, has made his pace in the south of France with Gilles Savara, and that has been uh, perfect for him. Pospisil in the opening round, Kabeas Benya in the second round, Krajanovic in five. A couple of sets there were probably uh, the roughest that he's had in the tournament, just mentally. Mackenzie McDonald had a great tournament here, getting through to the fourth round, but dispatched in straight sets. Tough match, it looked on paper against Rublev, but he wore him down before that wonderful win, of course, in the semi-finals against Tsitsipas. 
it's been uh, the toughest route through at a major ever in terms of sets loss for this man but he's never won a major of course without dropping a set so I'm sure that's not going to bother him. The most important thing for him, he comes into this men's final fit and healthy. He said he felt the best that he's felt the entire tournament after his semi-final. Ominous signs for Medvedev tonight. Look at that, $145 million in prize money. But he wants something tonight that money simply can't buy. Shardy in the opening round. The American, it was a good tussle. Hot day that day as well against Tiafo Fritz. That's when the injury seemed to occur. And the match was getting away from him, but he won it in five. Raonic, the big server in the fourth round, dispatched him four, as was Zverev, before the uh, man of the tournament, Karatsev, who came from nowhere. In fact, he didn't come from nowhere, he came from Doha, in qualifying to make the semi-finals in his debut. Before he was there, we see the Sir Norman Brooks Challenge Cup. And Novak has already won eight times and has yet to lose in a final here. Outstanding stat bewildering it is bewildering when you think about it eight finals eight titles uh, as you mentioned mark I and mean, if he's made it to sunday he's he, he's won it's been uh, four three in the head, head. brad just quickly what do you think Medvedev's got to do, apart from obviously play well? Give, give me one thing that you think he needs to try and do better than he's maybe done in the tournament so far. Well, I don't know if it's one thing for me. I, I think what it's going to come down to is how he handles the pressure moments in the match. We know how Novak has handled pressure moments. We know he's comfortable given his history and how many times he's been in these kind of positions. I really think that Daniel Medvedev, given his previous one final is going to be more comfortable Ladies tonight and, and we saw that head to head he's got some wins over novak i novak think he's going to come in tonight and on this surface he's serve. actually going to feel pretty comfortable and confident it's going to make seconds. a big difference how he goes early on but it's also a long match and uh, i i think in the end like i said from the start how are you going to perform when you get to 30 all if you get a break point are you going to be able to step up and play those points to your max capability and take those points away from novak djokovic who's probably the greatest counter puncher of our of our era maybe of all time and you could add into there one of the if not the best defender of all time and it's gonna be special 